All right, this is Robert Porsche with the YouTube channel Truth, and uh, I just wanted to go over a couple of things with you right now and uh, show you a little bit of my broadcast studio. Uh, one of the dynamics with this is that um, uh, there's my big screen right there, and uh, this is uh, a projection off of this mirror. It's just kind of an interesting way to, uh, to go ahead and do that. I want to show you how reality helps expose the impossibility of the globe. We've got the uh, crystal bell there, not moving at all. Okay. And then I'll, I'll want to stabilize it a bit. Okay, notice that? No movement. Uh, just simply proving that it's, that it's real. It's... Uh, it really, uh, what, does, uh, what does a crystal bell do? Well, it'll do that. All right, I'll just set that down there. It'll, it'll take a while to stabilize. Now I can, uh, I can actually set that down a little bit more gentle. And uh, this is uh, some of the water that the kitties drink out of. We got uh, quite a few plants in here to help add uh, oxygen to the environment. We've got the non-movement of the uh, bubble on the window ledge. It's level. Outside the window, I've got that very same crystal bell uh, sitting on top of a sheet of ice that was on there a couple days ago. Uh, there's the beautiful gazing pond in our backyard. The, um, the temperature tonight is going to be about 70 degrees colder in Wisconsin than here. The ocean is located about seven miles away uh, south from here, and we've had a lot of uh, wind coming from the south where it's quite a bit warmer. Here's the uh, water jug that I show quite often in my videography and photography. More uh, water the cats like to drink out of. Yeah, like uh, there's uh, footprints on the mirror. That uh, mirror right there was actually on the uh, pool table. That's a pool table with a Select Comfort uh, mattress on top. I can uh, take it off and on in a matter of moments. Uh, this right up here is the audio Bible merged with the beauty of creation. All who own the pool, who take such a view of things. And if on some point you think differently, that too God will make clear to you. Only let us live up to what we have already attained. Join with others in following my example, brother. Take note of those who live according to the pattern you gave me. So, to be clear, this is uh, water seeking its level. Very easy to see. I'm going to go ahead and uh, mute that for a moment, uh, for right now. Uh, water seeking its level right at the ocean. Uh, that is right over there. And then uh, we've got water seeking its level here. It's just what it does. What I've done too is I, I bought uh, 10 of these water jugs. I fill them with my reverse osmosis, use a uh, water system, use a little bit of baking soda, and, uh, and also uh, exfoliate with the scrubbing gloves, put a little coconut oil on, and um, I'm able to sit in the tub and uh, watch the, uh, I can watch the, so let me show you. Uh, like when I'm in the tub, I can uh, sit right here and watch the TV that's on the back wall over where? Well, right here. So it's all very interesting. The, each, each of the mirrors is like a set of eyes on the wall so that like when I'm in my uh, primary, uh, one of the chairs that I, I sit in quite a bit right here, uh, there's a, a view of, um, you know, I could sit and look at myself. That's not what the mirrors are for. They're not to see me, it's to see all around. 
that's kind of what that's uh, actually about. So I'm going to take us outside. This is a, a bit of a sound check too because I was having trouble with my uh, mobile mic. Oh, so here we go. Let's uh, let's show you the non-movement of the of the crystal bell there. Now let me see if I can uh, set that down. <coughs> I want to do that in a way that will allow me to show you real clear. There we go. That's a good contrast, and I, I don't want to move the, uh, the piece at all. Yeah, that's me moving back and forth, blocking a, a little of the light. Now I can, uh, I can take this. That's kind of interesting, isn't it? So what that is, is the high intensity rechargeable USB light, like a thousand um, lumens. So like um, I'm shooting it over here and then it's uh, bouncing over there. The, the lighting is a big deal. It's all pretty uh, interesting to me. The, the way that the, the light reflects what it shows. Take us outside for a bit here and show you what it's like out here. A beautiful day with a lot of uh, what appear to be pretty natural clouds. Uh, but keep in mind there's modified weather all over the place. Uh, right in the middle of the view there is the, um, let me see if I can zoom in on that. Okay. That little spot right in the middle there reflects the uh, street light that's right up there in the middle of the view. From this vantage point, I've, uh, I've demonstrated that. So when the truth is right in front of you, will you be able to see it? Will you recognize it? You can hashtag YouTube truth and, uh, and see what I'm talking about. Uh, this is where we live. I wanted to uh, show you that in the summer, the sun comes up over here and uh, drops behind the house over here. In the uh, winter, the sun actually comes up over there and uh, moves a course above the face of the earth and drops uh, below over there. That's just what it does. Uh, we don't have upside down wind chimes in relationship to uh, these wind chimes. Yeah, that's just what it does. That's just how it actually works. So. Uh, sometimes people <coughs> will come up to me on the beach. Uh, they'll come up to me in my neighborhood here, our neighborhood, and ask, uh, what is YouTube truth? What's it all about? Well, I've merged an audio Bible with the uh, beauty and majesty of creation as well as uh, exposing a lot of the conspiracies, the kaleidoscope of conspiracies that are actually inundating humanity. I thought you should know uh, that we don't live on a globe, we didn't go to the moon, and we still got monkeys. Alrighty then, there you go. Go ahead and hashtag YouTube Truth, I'll sub to you if I can. Oh, look at that, there's the sun. No, that's the reflection of the sun. A rather local, small sun. According to scripture, the sun moves a course above the face of the earth, as does the moon. The greater light for the day the lesser light at night. Looks like a bit of a ring around the, the sun. What we've got now is uh, the, the wind coming out of the southwest. Earlier today it was out of the southeast. All between anywhere from 18 to 22 miles an hour. What that means is we're getting a tropical breeze coming from where there's uh, a huge thermal sink, the uh, ocean that's warmed up by the sun, and we get warm air here. 
when the wind comes out of the north, northeast or north uh, northeast or northwest, it gets cold here. We're right at the coast, so that's how that works. That's the truth.